you can take one of these off today. And every day we'll take one off and that'll be one day closer to moving into our new house. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I broke it in peace. It's okay. Should we count how many days now until we move? Yes. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, fourteen. Until days until we move. Twenty-two days until we move. The countdown is on. But um, today is Thursday, and we have we're gonna have a fun day today. First things first is we're going to the gym. I'm gonna get a workout in, and then I have a chiropractor appointment. And then we're gonna go swimming because our pool's finally open and we haven't been swimming in a long time. So today I have blocked out our schedule to spend the afternoon at the pool. Also, apparently Scarlett's just her normal everyday wake up time now is at at the latest 6 a.m. I'm kind of starting to get used to it and it's actually, it helps me be more productive because I get up in the morning and start um, getting things done before I even have things scheduled. I am definitely most productive in the morning. So as much as it sucks waking up early, it's also been really productive for me. Um, today I got up, got a video posted, got some emails responded to, and now we are not rushing out the door like we typically are. We actually have about 20 minutes to kill before we have to leave. And usually we're rushing out the door. So perks of waking up early, I definitely will say. I just typically put my pre-workout powder in here. And then when I get to my gym that I'm working out at, I add water and then I drink it. This usually hits me within like 10 minutes of drinking it. So I don't wanna drink this until we're actually getting started with the workout. All right, blow it out. This is her favorite part of the day. <laughs> Careful, don't touch though. Wow. Super hot. It is a couple hours later now. It's 11 o'clock. We've been to the gym, had a great workout, and then I just got out of the chiropractor. We are heading home right now. I had some vascular testing done, and um, it's good to know my veins are working properly, so I have good circulation. Today at the chiropractor, I got an, inject an injection shot in my hips because they're a little bit tilted so we're trying to work on that i have been having some really bad back pain this week like mid to lower back and i have to say my appointment yesterday with the cairo and then today between those two appointments my back feels so much better it's crazy um, so it's definitely working for me on another note please excuse my appearance today this is just gonna be me since we're going to the pool um and i just got some good news from ty which i'll explain here in a little bit we're home Stopped by Starbucks. It's like an overcast day today, so it's gonna be perfect for the pool. It's still like 110 degrees out, but um, the sun is not blaring down, which will be really nice. Anyways, guys, house update. So we, I mean, okay, I've been getting this question a lot. The house buying process, if you don't know, especially when you're buying like a new build house through builders and um, like a VA loan and when you're not married and stuff, there's a lot of hoops you kind of have to jump through sometimes. We've been having like just to provide so much documentation and so many um, like different things because we're not married and we're buying a house together and it's just been not, um, nothing's been like not in our favor. It's just been a lot of back and forth. Finally, I can tell you guys that we are officially gonna be set to move in. Our loan's approved. We have like everything, like all of our ducks in a row. So I'm comfortable telling you guys that we're good. However, you never know. Something could go wrong. You never know. Until those keys are in my hand, I'm not gonna be like, okay, it's ours. <laughs> but we obviously have to make plans too because I have to be out of my apartment. So we have like everything scheduled, movers scheduled, utilities transferred over. Um, we are set to go. But again, until I have those keys in my hand, I'll feel, I'll feel comfortable saying it's actually ours. Um, but I'm so excited. So, so excited. I'm glad like the approval stuff's over. That's like the most stressful part is getting all of that figured out. A lot of times you're pre-approved when you go to buy a house, but for us, we were buying a house this way. We had to go through the bank through our builder. So we had to go through the approval process while we were also in escrow, but we are good to go now. And now we just wait and um, we move in three weeks and I cannot wait. I'm so, so, so excited. I am at that point here at my apartment where I just don't, I don't want to cook. I don't want to clean. I don't want to pick up a room. But anyways, that's my good news. That's 
my final house update um we will be moving in a couple of weeks and i'll be taking you guys along through all of that i'll be sharing an empty house tour there's going to be so many fun videos coming up uh, a lot of you guys want me to do more cleaning videos and decorating videos and i really want to do that i just it hasn't made sense to do it at this apartment anymore those are videos i really want to make but just hang in there with me. Anyways, that's my exciting news. The house is our, ours, it's been ours. We didn't have a, um, like we bought it directly from the builder. There wasn't a negotiation on a price or anything. Like it's literally you buy as is. And um, so that was the easy part. The annoying part's been the approval and stuff like that. But we're good to go, good to go. So excited. We are all set for the pool. Scar, what did you get? She got one of these little mini popsicles. I am so excited our pool's open and I still can't believe nobody's ever here. It's crazy, I don't even know why they closed it because literally nobody's ever here except us. <laughs> the towel? There you go. Seriously though, even pre-pandemic, there was nobody ever at our pool. Nobody is ever here, even in the evenings, even on the weekends. It's crazy, I don't get it, I don't understand. It's only 100 degrees out. I am so ready for things to cool off. Um, a lot of people have been asking if we have a pool at our new house, and we don't have one at our actual house, but the community we're moving to is like, uh, it's a very active community, so there is anything and everything you could think of. There's multiple pools, there's, um, like 12 parks, there's a splash pad, there's like a community center, um, a gym, there's so much. So where we're moving is gonna be perfect for our active lifestyle. There's walking trails. Um, I'm really, really, really excited. But yes, we will still be able to uh, be outside in the pool. The pool there is really cool too. There's like water slides and stuff. Um, so as she gets older, she's gonna love that. But that was a must have for me um, when buying a house this round. Um, I definitely wanted like that fun community vibe that is offered here in Arizona. And um, yeah, I'm really excited about the community. But I am dying in here right now. I'm gonna go jump in the pool, play with Scarlett for a little bit. We're kind of at that point in the summer where even the pool isn't cold. <laughs> it, it gets like this towards like August, September. It's been so hot, the pool feels like bath water. Definitely not refreshing, but it's better than nothing. Hey guys, it's a lot later now. It's almost five o'clock. Scarlett took a nap today, which she hasn't napped forever. She's coloring right now. She doesn't have pants on, so she's not gonna be in the vlog. Um, and I just like sat on the couch, watched some Grey's Anatomy, and got some work done. Why are you so cute? You're in a great mood now. Did you have a fun time at the pool? Yes. Yes. Guess what tomorrow is? School. Yeah. How much? How much do you love school? How much do you love school? Very much. Yeah, she's like obsessed with her school. I'm so happy she likes it so much. Anyways, I'm gonna actually do some cleaning up. I, I don't want to, but I'm going to. Change the scenery. Yeah. Everybody's smoking all the greenery. Yeah. Close the match because they were handed down to me. But I'm still fly. I'm still fly. I know. I'm still fly, I'm still fly, let's go. It could all be worse, I could be a hater like you. It could all be worse. Clues to make the man, but that poison's gonna chew you. From the inside out, so right now. Say it with your chest now, say it with your chest now. I'm young.
to all the haters because you proved to me. Everything is clean. Scarlett's taking pictures of Indy. Let me see. Did you do it? Her little camera's from Amazon. I'll link it. She loves it. She loves taking pictures. Just like mama, huh? I got a lot of pictures. You do. Hey, buddy. We also just got her bags packed because, hey, Scarlett, where are you going tomorrow after school? Nana. Nana. She's going to go spend the weekend with Nana. She's so excited. So is mommy and daddy. We're going to have a date night. <laughs> we have zero plans for the rest of the evening. I'm like <laughs> hanging out by a thread. I'm so tired, being tired on top of being out in the heat um, in the sun is just too much sometimes and I'm like really feeling it right now considering making a coffee and it's 5 30 at night but we don't have any plans tonight so <laughs> this is pretty much our night just playing around oh I forgot to tell you guys our downstairs neighbors moved out which is awesome because I don't care if she runs or jumps now because we don't have neighbors downstairs so this is actually it's actually been really nice hey Scarlett can you tell me about some dinosaurs it's a T-Rex. A T-Rex. And what is the dinosaur that runs really fast? Galli Memus. Galli Yes. And what is the really tall dinosaur? Bronco. Bronchiosaurus. What's the one with the the tail that has like the ball on its tail? Ankylosaurus. Ankylosaurus? Uh, what's the Pachy... What's that one? Pachy. Tachycephalosaurus. So Scarlett's thing right now is dinosaurs. She's super into dinosaurs. When you eat all That's this, like her thing. When, when you eat all this, you get surprised. I'm it. so excited. We're in her room right now just playing. Oh, thank you. She made me coffee. Can I, I said I needed coffee. Preheating the air fryer. It's almost seven o'clock. Scarlett's in the bath. I'm gonna cook some sweet potato fries, I think. So I just peeled this, I'm gonna cut it up and get it in the air fryer. But guys, look at the sun. I don't know if my camera's gonna pick it up, but it's like legit pink outside. Um, let me see if I can show you guys. It's beautiful. It is so pretty outside right now, but my camera's not even doing it justice. Okay, so to make these, I'm just gonna add some coconut oil, which I just heated up so it was um, a little bit more liquid. This is um, Maldon salt, I think is how you say it, but it's like that flaky, chunky salt that is delicious. This is the best salt, by the way. Um, but I think it's called Maldon, M-A-L-D-O-N. And I'm also just gonna add some red pepper flakes. I guess that isn't red pepper flakes, that's just ground red pepper. And I'm gonna mix those up. Fries are done, it took about 10 minutes. And here's what they look like. Yum, they look super good. I'll show you what I'm gonna dip these in. This hummus is my new favorite. You can get this at a couple different places. I think Target might carry this. I don't know if they carry this flavor though. This is from um, Sprouts. The Thai coconut curry hummus by Hope is fabulous. And I think this will be a really good mixture, dipping these in this, and this is almost gone. So that is gonna be my little snacky dinner for the night. If I'm still hungry, I'll probably just make a sandwich. That's what Scarlett had for dinner. I look so tired. We just took Indy outside, and Scarlett, what's happening outside? It was raining. It is raining outside. We've been getting some rain this week. Anyways, I am going to end <laughs> I'm in the vlog. So thank you guys for following along with today's day in the life video and I mm. hope you guys enjoyed it. Hi. We are so excited for our new house. Yes, subscribe to our channel and watch more videos. Bye. Seriously though, I can't wait to take you guys along with everything in this new journey. And this okay, new bye Campbell. Okay, I'm gonna, gonna call it a night and get this baby to bed. <laughs> we'll see you guys in our next one. Bye. bye.